Hi guys, I found another book that's sort of Halloweeny. <laughs> In the um interest of the season of Halloween. Little witch takes charge. That's little witch. She's gonna take charge. It says by Deborah Haltzig and illustrated by Sylvie Wickstrom. Front cover, back cover. Right, the front of every book is the front cover. The back of every book is the back cover. And not every book has a title page, but this one does. Title page, where it says the title again, Little Witch Takes Charge. Okay, you gotta bear with me. This is a longer book. You guys can make it. it it's, it's a very cute story. I like it. Happy story. We always read from left to right and top to bottom. And left to right, you know, this page to this page, right? Okay. And then we turn the next page. Late one night, Little Witch was fast asleep. Her bat, Scrubby, was hanging from the bedpost. Her cat, Bow Wow, was under her bed. Suddenly a noise woke Little Witch up. Achoo! It was the loudest sneeze she had ever heard. Achoo! Achoo! Uh oh. Little witch jumped out of bed and followed the sneezes to the kitchen. All the witches were there and all of them were sick. Oh, look, here's the sick witches. There's little witch. There's one, two, three, four sick witches. They're probably her aunties. Too old to be her sisters. So maybe aunties and mom? I don't know. Aunt Nasty, oh, that's an auntie, was sneezing. Aunt Grouchy was coughing. Mother Witch, oh, Mother, which one's Mother? Mother Witch was coughing and sneezing. And Cousin Dippy, your nose is running. Okay, this is Cousin Dippy, because her nose is running. Said Little Witch, where, where, cried Cousin Dippy, looking under the table. She's trying to give her a tissue. Your nose is running. We call it, when snots are coming out of your nose, we call that a runny nose. I don't know why. Things are, snots are running down your face out of your nose. Runny nose. And achoo! That's a sneeze. And <coughs> that's a cough, okay? All right. I can't quite tell who's who other than that. Okay. Here's a little witch handing her tissue. It's running right here. I am the only witch who isn't sick, said little witch, so I am taking charge. Everybody go back to bed. I will help you get better. Little witch went back to her room where she said a magic spell. Oogala rugala cinnamon snot. I need a witch doctor on the spot. Poof. Oh, there he is. A witch doctor landed on the spot on the floor. What am I doing here? You don't look sick, said the witch doctor. I'm not, but my family is. Can you help them? I'll try, said the witch doctor. The witch doctor. Here he is. <laughs> The witch doctor visited each witch. He said magic spells. He waved a magic wand. He even did a strange upside down get well dance, but nothing worked. Go away, yelled Aunt Nasty. Oh, that must be Aunt Nasty. Aunt Nasty. I'm trying to sleep, grumbled Aunt Grouchy. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, wait, I'm sorry. This has to be Aunt Nasty. Go away. Aunt Grouchy, I'm trying to sleep. Who are you? Says Cousin Mom. You're bothering us. Get lost, screamed Mother Witch. So that's Mom. <laughs> that's a, that's her mother. I will not be yelled at, yelled the witch doctor. And poof, he disappeared. Well, his spells weren't working anyway. Ah. I always have trouble turning pages. Okay, Ooh, there we go. Little witch had an idea. 
She went back to the kitchen and tried another magic spell. Ickity sickity sneezy goop. I will make some get well soup. Poof. A big black steaming pot appeared. Oh. Little witch filled up four bowls and put them on a tray. Okay, Bow Wow, let's bring everybody their snake soup. <laughs> Snakes are actually edible, believe it or not. First little witch went to Aunt Nasty and Aunt Grouchy's room. I made some soup to help you get well, said little witch. I don't want any. Achoo! Soup, said Aunt Nasty. Go away, don't bother me again. Aunt Grouchy tasted the soup. This is horrible, she grumbled. Take it away. <laughs> little witch hoped Cousin Dippy would like the soup. When she stepped inside her room, Cousin Dippy was wiping her nose to make sure it was still there. Look, said the little witch, get well soon, Soup. Oh dear, said Cousin Dippy, is the soup sick too? No, it's to help you get well, explained the little witch, handing her the bowl. Your nose is running again. Where? cried Cousin Dippy. She sat up and spilled the soup everywhere. Oh, don't worry, said the little witch wearily. I'll clean it up. She spilled the soup. Where? Soup is good food. Little Witch was very tired, but she still had to take care of Mother Witch. She brought her some soup next. What's that? said Mother Witch suspiciously. It's to help you get well, said Little Witch. Where will you stop being so nice? shrieked Mother Witch. She sneezed. Achoo! and drooled and coughed <laughs> like a barking seal. Bow Wow ran out of the room. Little Witch turned right around and followed her. By now it was the middle of the night and Little Witch really needed some sleep. So it looks like she's going to bed. Maybe they'll let me help in the morning, she said to Bow Wow. Little Witch went back to bed. She was just falling asleep when Aunt Nasty called her. Let me try that soup again, she said. I want some fried worms, cried Aunt Grouchy. Is it lunchtime? asked Cousin Dippy. I'm lonely. I think I have a fever, called Mother Witch. They sound a little childish to me. Little Witch did her best to take care of everyone. She got the soup, fried the worms, gave tissues to Cousin Dippy, and kept Mother Witch company while Scrubby fanned her with his wings. Oh, Right, that's Scrubby, her little pet bat. Tell me a story, little witch, said Mother Witch. Once upon a time, said Little Witch, and then she yawned. I can't think of any. I'm so tired. Little Witch wanted to make Mother Witch happy, but she just couldn't keep her eyes open. Oh, it's making me yawn. Just think about it. <laughs> Thinking about it. You're not helping, shrieked Mother Witch. You always help. Two angry tears, uh-oh, rolled down Little Witch's face. I am taking care of everyone, she cried. Who is taking care of me? Oh, uh-oh, she's sad too now. Uh-oh. Oh. Do we yell at people who are being nice to us? No. That is not appropriate. When people are being nice to us, we say, thank you. Thank you. Right? Thank you. Mother Witch began to smile. Are you achoo? Mad at me? Asked Mother Witch. No, said Little Witch. Are you sure? Said Mother Witch. Cough, cough. <coughs> no, cried Little Witch. I mean, yes, I am mad at you. I am mad at everyone. You are all driving me crazy. <laughs> there she is. She's yelling and screaming. There's Mother Witch. Mother Witch clapped her hands and did a dance on the bed. 
Hooray! Little Witch is angry. She's not being nice. I am so proud of you, Little Witch. This is even better than hearing a story. And then Mother Witch fell fast asleep. It sounds like Mother Witch is trying to teach um, a Little Witch to be mean and not nice. Hmm. Why would anybody do that? The next morning, the witches were feeling a little bit better. But there was nobody to make breakfast for Little Witch, so she made her own. Yum! Broccoli for breakfast! Mmm, nice and healthy. <laughs> Whispered Little Witch, Mother Witch never lets me eat broccoli. I'm lucky to get to take care of myself today. Then she made get well cards for all the witches. She also made her bed and cleaned her room. Mother Witch hates it when my room is neat, but she won't see it, Little Witch told Scrubby. <laughs> it says, Dear Aunt Nasty, get well soon. Dear Aunt Crouchy, get well soon. Dear Cousin Dippy, get well soon. Dear Mother Witch, get well soon. Look at the pretty little get well cards. Very nice and sweet. Little Witch, what are you doing? shrieked Mother Witch from the other room. Something you won't like, yelled Little Witch. Hooray, yelled Mother Witch happily. Keep on doing it. It's nice to take care of everyone, Little Witch said to Bow Wow. But it's fun to take care of myself, too. I think I'll make myself some spinach for dinner. <laughs> and that's just what she did. My daughter does that, too. She likes um spinach and mushroom macaroni. <laughs> <laughs> she makes that for herself all the time. <laughs> um, there we go. The end. That was Little Witch. It's a very nice story about a little witch taking care of her sick mom and aunties and cousin. Bye. Happy Halloween.